Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to fix error code 268 on Roblox. So if you're getting this uh, disconnected error code right here that says you have been kicked due to unexpected client behavior, error code 268, and I'll show you guys exactly how to fix this problem in this video today. So there's a couple of reasons why you might have been kicked. One of the main ones is you might have been hacking or something was wrong with your Wi-Fi that made it seem strange. So if you guys want to fix it, just watch this video. I'll show you guys exactly how to fix it in this video today. So the first thing that I can suggest you doing is just restarting your PC. Uh, a lot of times it's just something to do with the PC. So if you restart it, then that might just fix it really easily. But if that doesn't work, then what you want to do, you want to go down here and you want to search for Roblox and Roblox player. Once you search for it, you're going to want to look for the open file uh, location. So right click on it and then click open file location. It will bring you to this uh, menu right here. And on this menu, you want to right click on the Roblox player. And then you want to go to properties, which is at the bottom once you right click on it. Now, once you go to properties, you're going to be brought to this page here. And on this page, you're going to want to look for the compatibility option right here. Once you find the compatibility option, you're going to want to click on uh, this compatibility mode. You want to click run this program in compatibility mode for and check that right there and then change it to Windows 7. Now, once you do that, you're going to want to make sure that you run this program as an administrator down here. And once you do both of those, just click apply and then click OK. Once you do that, you're going to want to write, you're going to be brought to the back of this page here. And you want to right click on the Roblox player again. And then you want to look for the troubleshoot compatibility option right here. Once you find that, just click on it. And then this will just troubleshoot it with Roblox. And once uh, you've done that, you want to click on the try recommended settings option that shows up right here. Now, once you do that, it's going to ask you to test the compatibility settings for the program. So if you just click test the program, if it opens like this, then that means it worked. If it didn't work, however, then the, what I would suggest doing is just deleting Roblox. So to delete Roblox, you're just, wanna, you're just gonna want to go to, not completely delete it, but you just go to app data, uh, percentage, app data, percentage, and you'll, you'll see this file folder right here. Click on it, it'll bring you to this page here. On this page, you want to, at the top, there should be an option right before roaming for app data. Go to that and you'll be brought to this page here. On this page, you want to go to local right here, double click on that, and you'll be brought to this page where it shows all your apps. Here, you want to scroll down until you find Roblox. And once you find it, right click on it and then just click delete. Once you delete it, it's going to uh, say deleted it and after that, you can head over to the Roblox uh, website. And once you head over to the Roblox website, you're going to want to go to a game and then just play that game. And then it will say Roblox is not loading. And you're going to have to install it one more time. So just wait for this and click download and install, open, and then wait for it to download all the way. As you can see here, it's doing that real quick. Now, once it's done that, you can just click OK and then click play allow that and you should be able to join the game. As you can see, it's starting Roblox and there we go. It now works. So that is how you fix your uh, error code 268 on Roblox. So if neither of these options, if none of these options uh, worked, these methods worked, then I would suggest just uh, asking Roblox support for help. But if they did work, I'd really appreciate a like and subscribe. If you have any questions you have in the comment section below, I'll do my best to answer them. And uh, I'll see you guys next time.